All right, what's up, guys? Welcome to another Is It Worth Getting video. And in today's video, I will not be talking about a video game, but somewhere a video game can be played on. I will be talking on the Nintendo Switch. All right, this is the OLED. This is so this is like the latest model of the Switch, the one that I think everybody should um, own. But if you do own the original Switch, Ain't no issues about it. Um, it's just with this one, uh, I think, uh, like, yeah, it's, the screen is better, battery is better, a little bit bigger, and, uh, yeah, like, slight changes to it, because I had the original Switch at one point in time, excuse me, and then I ended up, um, selling that one and then getting this one, so, and, uh, yeah, it's nice. There ain't, like, really, like I said, no big major differences besides the battery life and then the, uh, screen. Um, but if you don't care about that type of stuff, then it shouldn't even matter. But is the Nintendo Switch um, still worth getting in uh, 2023? I would say yes. I've been playing it a little bit recently. And I don't even know. I was getting ready to like set it down. Now, I, I want to like showcase all right, this device in the video. But <clears throat> no, there's a lot to do with it recently. Well, I don't know exactly when. But that's, um, recently when I started back playing it again... Um, I seen that they added um, some old uh, Game Boy and Game Boy Advance games on it. And I had the Game Boy Advance. Like, I remember getting it years ago when I was a kid for Christmas. And so seeing it and being able to like play some games. Um, there were some games I used to have, but I can't play them anymore. But I'm like, to just know that they did that, I'm like, I think it's pretty sick. And I can't wait to see what other games they add. Um, but yeah, if you get like their uh, um, subscription service, yeah, you, there's like all these different games that you can um, play like from the Super Nintendo, Nintendo 64, uh, there's like some other consoles. What I am waiting for, I'm hoping that they might uh, add like maybe GameCube, uh, the original Nintendo Wii. Um, what are some other ones? Yeah, there's there's a lot that they can uh, add to here, and I'm like, I think it would be sick. And I the reason why I would like to see the Nintendo um, Wii like games on here is because of uh, Mario Kart. In my opinion, Mario Kart Wii was like one of the best Mario Kart like games of all time. Like I've played the Nintendo 64, I played the original Mario Kart, um, the Mario Kart that's on the Switch, uh, like Eight Deluxe. Um, there's, yeah, quite a few, but Mario Kart Wii was, like, hands down the greatest. Like, if it means that I can't, you know, use the steering wheel that it came with, so be it. I'll use the controller, but still, it was fun, all right? But anyways, um, but yeah, from that to other titles, um, one thing that I will say, like, uh, a downfall to it is that, uh, even though, like, you have the subscription service for, uh, Nintendo... It's not like with the Xbox and PlayStation where there's uh, exclusives that you can play and you don't have to buy them. Like, I would like to see that on here, but no, they're going to probably raise the price if they were to do some stuff like that. So I have to say, like, out of all of the services, it's cheap. But they are. Right, so actually, you know, no, I take that back. Um, they you do uh, you can play like the original, like the um, like Nintendo 64 games uh game boy so you can play those games like at no extra cost like all you're just doing is paying for the uh um the nintendo service and things but i just wish there was like the newer ones too you know like just 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 a, a tad bit more and things i know i'm being greedy all right but i just wish all right so but um other than that um no i would say like it, it definitely it is worth getting in uh 2023 so if you haven't had a chance to get you a nintendo switch and you need like a a wake up call or a sign this is your wake up call this is your sign go out buy a nintendo switch i actually had got this from amazon so you get i think nintendo switches it's not like how it was at one point in time where they were hard to get you can most likely get these anywhere so um and i think it's been out for a while so people ain't gonna really be you know all like out and about like looking for them and buying them and stuff like i don't know it might depend on where you're at but um i think for the most part you should be fine on if you're trying to get you a nintendo switch so but anyways and that being said i will talk to you guys later thank you guys for watching like subscribe if you're new to the channel and peace